Let me tell you a story about the legend of Pancho Diablo. According to the legend, Pancho Diablo was the greatest gambler in all of Mexico. As the story goes, he could not be beat. The fact that he could not be beat did create suspicion. It wasn't long to those who lost money to Pancho decided he must be a cheat. And they conspired to kill him by poisoning his tequila. Pancho won his last game on the same night that he was murdered. And he was murdered. He did not go easily, though. After drinking six shots of the poisoned tequila, he was still playing and still winning. Frustrated, one of the other players pulled out a knife and stabbed Pancho six times. Pancho laid on the ground bleeding for quite some time. After what seemed like an eternity, he was still moving. Another conspirator pulled out his pistol and loaded six rounds into Pancho's belly. But Pancho was still moving. He had drank six shots of the poison tequila, had been stabbed six times, and had been shot six times. He was still moving. Not knowing, not knowing what to do, the killers bound his body with rope and carried him on horseback to the river. Threw him in. His body was never recovered. After they disposed of the body, the killers examined his belongings. And all they found was a bloody, soaked deck of cards. Expecting to find some type of gaff, or even at least an extra set of aces, they were surprised to find it was just a plain deck of cards. They had killed an honest man. And according to Mexican folklore, an honest man is killed unjust. The soul never rests. Still to the state fishermen of that river, report sightings of Poncho along the riverbank at night, often levitating several feet in the air above the water. And as the legend goes, song whispers his name three times while touching a deck of cards. If they are an honest soul, Poncho will appear. in this deck. I guarantee you, my friend. Just like that night. All it is is an honest deck of cards. <laughs> 